Hey guys, Yvonne here at YvonneMana.com. In this video, I wanna show you how to create expanded text ads with Google Ads now that they're slowly trying to phase them out. So if you click on the little plus sign in your Google Ads campaign dashboard, you will no longer see a text ads here. And if you go into your specific ad group and you click on the plus sign, you just see a responsive search ad. Now, if you do click on responsive search ad and you select your ad group, you might see the option to use expanded text ads but sometimes you won't. And eventually it looks like Google will completely remove this option. So what do you do? How do you create these text ads without this option? So let me cancel this here really quickly just to show you. So let's use this as an example. So we're gonna get straight into it. This is a text ad. So let's suppose we want this headline here, RSVP to get our demo booth. We want this to be in headline one. We want get started right now to be in headline two. And we want a quick and simple process in headline one. So basically we're gonna recreate this using the responsive search ad format, okay? And that's what I'm gonna show you right here. So we're gonna click on plus sign, click on responsive search ad, select our ad group. So this is pre-populated because I already have a text ad, but if you don't, then you're gonna simply write these things out. So the first thing you wanna do is write out what you want in each headline spot. So if you want this in headline one, write that out. If you want this in headline two, write that out. And I think actually for us, this was in headline two, right? This is the call to action. We want this to be in headline two. So the way we create uh, these text ads is we're gonna utilize these pins. So for RSVP to get demo at our booth, I'm gonna click on this pin and say show only in position one. And now this thing here, this headline will only show in position one, just like a standard text ad where, you know, whatever you write in the first spot always shows up there. Get started right now, we're gonna pin this in the second position. And now this will only show up in the second headline right here. And then this one, we're gonna pin in the third. So what we just did guys is this is basically a text ad because now nothing is random. Uh, you know, Google's not gonna be testing this being in headline three and this being in headline one. We set exactly where we want this to be. And then for the description, we do the same thing. So if I don't remember what we said for our original one, but let's say we want this to be in our first description spot, we're gonna click here, show in position one. And then this one, we're gonna say show in position two. And voila, we basically created this expanded text ad because we said, where we want each of these specific headlines and descriptions to be in. So then if you want to split test this, you can either save ad and you can just create another option where you test different things or what you could do is if you go here, you click on edit, you could enter, so instead of get started right now, you say, for example, uh, sign up right now, for instance. And then here you can also pin this in position two. And now these two will be split test and you could do it that way. But that's basically how you create a text ad. Um, as you can see here, you have full control using the responsive search ad format in the case that Google completely removes text ads, which they are in the process of doing. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.